Some years, the supplemental budget isn't very much. There are very few adjustments to be made. This year, we're coming out of the pandemic. We had to pause a whole lot of projects that we were well into. Now we're having to catch up. Costs have changed. Needs have been identified. And we're working really hard to be both practical and forward thinking in this budget. A lot of what we are doing is maintenance and, op and preservation. We put, we're, we're paying a lot of attention to that. We're paying a lot of attention to the different communities. But we are also completing and per pushing forward on the things that are going to secure our future and are going to create incredible numbers of jobs. This is much bigger than just a supplemental budget. For instance, we have to repair and replace some of our ferries, and we are moving to electric ferries. Well, that seems like it would only benefit the, the place where the ferries go, but it doesn't. There are manufacturing parts of those ferries all over our state. My district has, uh, has a, a company that's building part of our new ferries on a wonderful location that hasn't been used in a while where the ships from World War II were built. And it wasn't being used. That's a lot of jobs in my district. And other parts of those ferries are being made in other parts of our district. We need, uh, we need to step up to the needs of our maritime fleets. And we will have the skills and the people to do that because of what we're investing in in just this one piece of this supplemental budget. We need to move forward. This is a budget that takes care of what we have. It, takes, it, it makes adjustments in the off year, but it lays the groundwork for our future. It's what our communities need, and it's what they deserve, and we're never going to be done, and we are always going to move forward. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The speaker's about to lock the roll call machine. The speaker has locked the roll call machine. Clerk will take the record. Mr. Speaker, there are 91 yeas, three nays, four excused. Having received a constitutional majority, engrossed substitute Senate Bill 5689 as amended by the House is declared passed.